Hey, Steve here with RV to Cycle. Today we got a couple of tips we're going to talk to you about. One of them is turning your Max Air fan into a ceiling fan, and the other one is the solution that we found for tail lights and turn signals to help out when you've got a bike rack that's obscuring what comes on the van. If that interests you, stay tuned. <laughs> What we used here on the back end is a product from Opt7. You can see it's pretty simple. It's, uh, it's a flexible strip. And what we did is we just used uh, denatured alcohol, or you can use regular alcohol, to clean the bumper off. Now, it looks really bad right now because we just came through um, some snow on our way back from Florida. I ran the wire up underneath. You can see zip tied it, came on down here, around the um, around the bar for the trailer hitch, and then I uh, plugged it into our trailer lights. I also have on this special bracket I made for our license plate, because it's not visible when you're carrying bikes. The license plate lights are also plugged in. So we used our trailer light four pin plug to connect our license plate lights as well as this light strip which is both turn signal brake light and if you want you can put your backup lights in here as well doing the backup lights is a bit more complicated because you have to tap into your existing backups and frankly i just didn't want to do that besides we have enough backup light even when the bikes are on there and we've got the, got them covered using the backup lights that come on the van gives us more than enough to see what we need to see how long have we had this on here uh, a long time i don't remember exactly when we got it but now we're going to go into the van and we'll look at tip number two we're going to talk about max air fan and how you can turn it into a ceiling fan, not just an intake or an exhaust. Step one, turn the fan on. Step two, make sure you have the air coming in. If it's not, push the yin yang button right down here. Once the air is coming in, then you're gonna push the close cover. Cover's closed, you have a ceiling fan. And as you can see, the cover is closed and the air is blowing downward. And that's how you turn the Max Air fan into a ceiling fan. Hope you got something out of this video. If you did, give us a thumbs up. We appreciate you watching. Look forward to seeing you again soon. Take care.